Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to control Dynamics of Motors. So here we are in our package, specifically in our source, in our, in our launch, launch files. So I'm going to take a look better in visual code. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna look at our package in Visual Code so it's better to have like a view of our package. So here we have the three YAML configuration files. Uh, in this case, I'm I'm using a a master and slave configuration. So I have two motors and I need this dual motor YAML so it configures both motors one with ID 11 and another with ID 21 uh, one is the first one is the, is the master and the, the second one is the slave so we need this control YAML you can check out on Roswiki uh, how to do that specifically I'm just gonna set the joint speed to 0 0.8 now we open our terminal and uh, before we we manage our configuration YAML files it's good to check if both motors are in the correct ID so we're going to use this Python script which is located below in the description and then we're gonna check in every baud rate uh, from the range of IDs from 1 to 25 if the motors are uh, still 11 and 21 ID with the baud rate of 57600 so you can see that the script gives that everything is okay so we're gonna just move on so as you can see ID 11 and ID 21 now we open our terminal and we give ROS launch in our package and we set the controller manager up as you can see it has found two motors both 11 ID and 21 ID uh, as we saw it has pinged our motors on the network so everything's fine now we're gonna launch our server and we're gonna give host topic list so you can see that the the action server is up so if it, everything is okay now since the server is up we can run up our client by going in in our works in our package workspace and running our script I mean our client so this is the code for our client so it asks me to give a command to so we we can control our joint so I gave 0 0.7 now I'm gonna give a negative position so it goes forth and backwards